And today marks the one year anniversary since the 988 Suicide and Crisis Lifeline launched. It connects someone having a mental health crisis to a trained professional, much like 911 connects you to first responders. Atlanta News First reporter Amanda Rose joins us to share more about the effort. And Amanda, have people been using it? Good morning, Chelsea. To put it simply, no. Most Americans don't realize you can call, text, or even send a chat message over to 988 and be connected with a licensed counselor who can help de-escalate a mental health crisis. That's coming from data from a new poll from the National Alliance on Mental Illness. The poll found more than 80% of U.S. adults didn't know about or hadn't even heard about dialing 988. Only 17% of people were very or somewhat familiar familiar with that number, but when it comes to young adults ages 18 to 29, they were actually more familiar with it. If something in your body breaks, call 911. That's easy thing to do. So what we're trying to do with 988 is really make that same connection. You know, if your mind, something's wrong with your mind, something's wrong with your, your state, um, then call 988. There shouldn't be any embarrassment. Everybody struggles. Uh, and so that's why 988 is so critical. If you don't know about this service, it's worth mentioning dialing 988 can not only help de-escalate a mental health crisis, but it can also help connect someone to life-saving resources. In Midtown, Amanda Rose, Atlanta News First.